Morro Bay just received millions of dollars in federal funding for harbor operations. I'm Mackenzie Diaz, your community reporter in Morro Bay, where we hear what exactly that funding will be used for. Morro Bay was given $14.46 million to address dredging needs and to maintain the harbor for commerce and boating safety. Morro Bay Mayor Carla Wixom says the funding will most likely be divided into two segments. This year for dredging the mouth of the bay, for navigation in the channel, and the second half of the money will be used, delayed and used for dredging the middle to the back of the bay for navigation in the channel there. Morro Bay is the safe harbor to many, a place where boats can easily get in and out, a luxury recreational and fishing place, and a home to the U.S. Coast Guard. But when a storm hits, some problems can occur. And as you know from beaches, the shallower the beach is, the bigger the waves are, and so that's the reason that it needs to be dredged every year. The dredging will start next year in May for the inlet part of Morro Bay, and the back channel will be done sometime in the fall, according to the Morro Bay Harbor Director. If not properly taken care of, sand would start to fill up the bay, the mayor says. And it would change the um, size of the boats that would be able to come in and out of our harbor. And if there's a story you'd like me to look into a little bit more, you can contact me on the number on the screen or by email or by scanning the QR code. In Morro Bay, Mackenzie Diaz, KSBY News.